Hey, do you want to learn how to make an elegant photo slideshow like the one you're watching right now? Then stay with me, I'll show you how. I will leave a link to the project file in the description below so you can download and practice along. Welcome to Awesome Slideshow Tutorial YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you how to make this awesome and elegant photo slideshow in CapCut PC in minutes. So let's not waste any more time. Let's dive right into CapCut. Click on new project and import your media. For the sake of this tutorial, I will be using only 6 images, but feel free to use as many images as you want. Highlight the images and click on this plus button to add to track on the timeline. Click here to select the ratio for the video. Click 16.9. Highlight the images, hold down the Alt key on your keyboard and drag down the image like this to duplicate them. Click on this eye icon to hide the images on the first track. Then highlight the images on the second track and crop them. Reveal the images on the first track by clicking this icon again. Highlight them and reduce the scale to 80%. Animation. The second part is to add animation to our images. So go ahead and click on animation and select combo. Search for 3D card one and double click on it to apply to the first image selected. Do the same for the next two images. But for the last three images, we're going to apply spiral shape three to them by selecting the image one after the other while double clicking on the animation to apply it. Let's go back to animation to apply it to our background images. For the first three images, we will apply stretch and distort and then apply distort and stretch to the last three images. Effect. The third part is effects. Click on effects, video effects, and light effects. Select pool reflection. Drag and drop it in between the first and the second track on the timeline. Then stretch it to match the length of the video. We can make some adjustment if we like right here. Go back to effects and click on 20, 24. Drag and drop it. Drag and drop sparkle spiral effect on the track above all the images. Stretch the effect to match the length of the video. You can also make adjustments to the details. Sound effect. Click on audio and select sound effect. Search for whoosh wind this very one and add it to the timeline adjust the volume then copy and paste it at the beginning of each of the images music sound finally we'll be 
adding a background music to our slideshow. You can just select one from here in CapCut and add to your project. But the problem is, you might have a copyright strike on YouTube. But if you are posting it on only TikTok, you don't have a problem. Go ahead and choose from there. But as for me, I have a music I want to use in the media. So let's go to the media, drag and drop the music on the timeline. And cut out the parts you don't need. Also, don't forget to add fade out to the end of the track right here. Finally, go back to effects. Click trending and select color force 4. This very one. Drag and add it to the timeline. Make sure you stretch it to match the length of the video. And that brings us to the end of the video. Let's check out the final product. Thank you for watching. If you enjoy this content, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more. Stay tuned for our next video and until then, take care.